Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Anup Singh. You are watching Aerotech Advanced YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss about classification of aircraft. On previous video, we already discussed the types of airplane or types of aircraft. We have seen the jet propulsion. We have already seen about the gas turbine engine. But today's topic is little bit different. With the help of this topic, classification of aircraft, you you guys are understand that how we are classified different different category of aircraft so let's start this video so guys the topic is classification of aircraft so guys there are total five classification uh, related to aircraft the first one is classification by wing configuration the one thing is missed so wing configuration second one is location and types of landing gear Third one is classification by power plants. Fourth one is types of fuselas. And fifth one is classification by purpose. So with the help of this all the points, we are classified the different different types of aircraft. We already seen the different category and types of the aircraft, but how we are going to classify. So that we are going to discuss in this video. So let's start with first point. There are five main parts of the aircraft or five primary components or elements of the aircraft we already know about that and we already discussed on the previous video but here I have to show you the all the five primary components of aircraft then you guys are understand the classification all the five uh, points related to classification of aircraft the first main component that is wing second is fuselage third is impinage impinage is the tail section of the aircraft then landing gears and then last fifth one is engine the control surface is the secondary component or secondary element of a aircraft structure but five main element or primary component of the aircraft is a wing fuselage impinage landing gears and engine so this is the five main or primary element or component of aircraft structure so first point or the first classification that is uh, the classification by wing configuration so aircraft is uh, classified by the wing configuration so let's see in the wing configuration the first is position of the wing so the position of the wing is also important to classify the different category of the aircraft that is low wing mid wing high wing so you can find out these types of uh, configuration of wing in different different uh, aircraft and the numbers of wing second one is number of wing that is also important you can find out monoplanes biplanes and triplane types of wing so number of wing is also important to classify the aircraft and third one is shape of the wing shape of the wing means the wing shape is delta wing diamond shaped wing swept wing gulf shaped wing rectangular type wing parabolic types of wing elliptical types of wing so there is a, so many shape of the wings are available so with the help of that you can classify the aircraft and position of the wing so position of the wing is also very important point in wing classification so that is first is conventional wing no tail or tailless wing horizontal tail canard type wing so this all the points related to wing configuration is important and determining the classification of aircraft the second classification point is uh, location and types of landing gear so aircraft is classified also by the location and types by, uh, types of landing gear and in the case of location and uh, types of landing gear you can find out retrachable types of landing gear non retrachable types of landing gear and tail wheel nose wheel that is a landing gear arrangement so this is a important point related to landing gear types of landing gear and location of the landing gear to classify the aircraft so here retrachable and not retrachable of landing gear is it means that the landing gear during the 
टेक अ परफॉर्मन्स एंड अदर फ्लाइट ऑपरेशन लैंडिंग गेयर इट इज रिट्रेचेबल बिकॉज इन ऑर्डर टू रिड्यूस द ड्रैग फोर्स ड्रैग इज डायरेक्टली प्रपोर्शनल टू द वेट इफ ड्रैग इज मोर सो वेट इज मोर इफ वेट इज मोर सो एयरक्राफ्ट रिक्वायर्ड मोर एफर्ट टू लिफ्ट द एयरक्राफ्ट सो रिक्वायर्ड मोर फ्यूल सो हियर आई एम गिविंग द शॉर्टकट सो ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट दिस फंडामेंटल सो रिट्रेचेबल टाइप्स ऑफ लैंडिंग एयर इज वाइडली यूजिंग नावर डे नॉन रिट्रेचेबल यू कैन फाइंड आउट इन हिस्ट्री ऑफ द एयरक्राफ्ट वैन इट इज स्टार्ट डेवलपिंग and then you can find out tail wheel nose wheel is the types of the landing gear arrangement so in the types of low nose wheel uh, types of landing gear arrangement you can find out tail wheel nose wheel that is the most popular landing gear arrangement nowadays also so this is the second point how the aircraft is classified with the help of location and types of landing gear third point related to classification of aircraft is classification by power plant so aircraft is classified by power plant depends upon the power plant means the engine of the aircraft so let's see in the case of uh, classification by power plant the first is types of the power plant the types of the power pl plant we already aware that is piston types of engine turbo prop engine turbo shaft engine turbo jet engine turbo fan engine rocket so this is the types of the uh, power plant the second is the number of engine so the number of engines is also deciding factor to classify the types of aircraft that is single engine aircraft twin engine air aircraft multi engine aircraft so that is also a very important point related to how to classify the aircraft then location of the engine is also important that is uh, the engine is located near to the nose in the fuselage it is submerged inside the wing or it is mounted near to the pylon so this three point in the power plant that is very important to classify the category of aircraft the fourth one is types of fuselage so the shape and types of the fuselage also important to classify the aircraft so let's see the round shape of the fuselage square shape of the fuselage oval shaped of the fuselage of aircraft is classified the types of aircraft or category of the aircraft if you see what i given in the picture the different shape of the fuselage you can find out in in category and different types so this is the fourth point related to classification of aircraft fifth point related to classification of an aircraft is uh, classification by purpose so the by purpose also we can classify the aircraft let's see we know that the different different uh, category of aircraft is available in the market for civil purpose means general purpose of aircraft cargo transport purpose of aircraft for fighting or spying operation purpose of aircraft so that i have mentioned that civil category cargo category military category of aircraft so by purpose also we are classifying the different types of aircraft so this is the four, fifth point and last point of classification of aircraft hope so you guys are understand in today topic that is the classification of aircraft we already seen in previous video what we are done the discussion about the jet propulsion gas turbine engine and types of the aircraft or airplane but this video is related to classification of aircraft many of the students are confused that uh, sir how aircraft is classified so that things we are discussed today so here in this video overally we are discussed the five main important points of classification of aircraft by configuration wing configuration by location and types of the landing gear classification by power plant by types of uh, fuselage and classification by purpose so this all the five points we are discuss how we are classified the, the aircraft in different different category so i hope so you guys are understand related to classification of aircraft and uh, give your comments valuable comments 
related to this video and what you guys are required for next video so i am going to prepared related to that topic so guys thank you for watching my video thank you so much